time I hit a home run, I open a pack in MLB The Show. Whoever I choose out of these packs gets added to this team. But I'm starting with an all common team, meaning I'm using players that don't have any power. So as long as I don't have any packs opened, hitting a home run is gonna be very tough. Um, I have no idea what his left fielder is doing. Oh, my, a slider right down the middle. Come on, ball, carry, do something. No. Knuckle curve right down the middle. It's hit somewhat hard. All right, I think we might need to cook here. because He's going to throw home. All right, we're going to try to send that runner home now. He didn't even tag. Free run. I will take every single run that I can get. <laughs> and he quit. We hit no homers, but we got to win. The reason that win is important because at different milestones, we're going to be opening up different packs along with the home runs that we hit. And since we got to win in game number one, we're going to open up a standard pack, which might not seem like a big deal, but we'll at least get some players better than commons to add to the team. Chris Bubik and Trace Thompson. So uh, the team really does not get much better. And these packs need to help build a god squad because at the end of this video, I have to play a ranked game with the final team. If I lose, every single player I open today needs to get closer. But I also have special challenges that we can complete. And if I complete any of these, we get to spin the favorite Wheel of 99s. Come on, Trace Thompson. You're the only one with like more than 50 power. And that's not a homer. Come on, ball. We need one homer, yes! An 88 mile per hour home run. Don't worry, I won't be playing here all video. Yes! Trace Thompson! And that's a power swing. And it's, it's not even hit to the warning track in this really small stadium. So I'm gonna be opening these packs in order by the season that they were released. So we have to start off with season one. And I think we gotta start off with Ernie Banks and then Nick Castellanos, Josh Donaldson, and Pudge. So we have five non-commons on the team, albeit some of these guys genuinely suck. What do you expect me to do with Pudge? Perfect, perfect. Come on, Pudge. Come on, ball, fly. Oh, for a second, I thought he didn't hit that out. Oh, Trace Thompson. Another power swing. Perfect, perfect. Scan, not swing at a ball challenge. I'm just desperate for these homers right now. And I just swung at so many bad pitches that inning. First one, I just need the best overall hitter of this bunch. I think I got to go Curtis Granderson. And then the second pack for that second homer, I think we're gonna go for Eric Davis. I need like a big home run total game right here. It has to happen. We need to keep upgrading this team. I'm getting desperate here. Oh, the Grandy Man can. Come on, ball. Yes, Ernie Banks. Oh, Pudge. Back to back to back jacks. And that completes our first challenge to spin the wheel of 99s. For the first time, I feel like I'm seeing hope. Well, it automatically sent him home. I cannot turn him around. I mean, a three homer game is fine. The win is neat too. So I end up choosing Troy Gloss, Craig Biggio, and then 92 Bryce Harper and Elvis Andrews out of this captain pack. And then it was time for the wheel of 99s. So I'd love a beefy boy hitter for our first 99. Who do we get? I have no idea what it says. That's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy how much better this team got in the span of just a couple games. Let's have a big game here. Come on. And I literally fly out with Mickey Man on my first at bat. Oh, Eric Davis. Troy Gloss. Look at the second we get an all diamond team, we start destroying the baseball. <coughs> Someone say something about destroying the baseball. <laughs> oh, that ball smacked. It's not a homer, but a beautiful swing. All right, the team, I'm loving the singles. I really am, but the, the challenge is to hit home runs. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Grand slam. Now that ball was destroyed. Does that have the likes, Bryce? Come on, you've got 65 pop. 
I think my next objective is to get Elvis Andrews out of this lineup. Never mind. You can say all you want. All right, Mickey. If you're going to be on this team, hit a tank. I, mean, I guess you don't have to, but I mean, I think you should hit a tank, Mickey Mantle. What a game for the team. Nine runs scored. We hit five home runs that game. And next up, we have event rewind packs. And in these packs, I'd add Gary Sheffield, Todd Helton, and Sean Manaya, so we could have some sort of starting pitching for that final game. And for our last couple packs, I opened the home run derby and all-star game packs, and we did not have any good luck. But Cody Bellinger and Sean Doolittle should help. And since I reached 10 home runs, we could open this pennant race pack. Andrew Vaughn, George Springer, Welcome to the team. But I still only had 199 overall, and he still was not performing. Scan hit a home run challenge. Impossible. Yes. We got one. Oh, Cody Bellinger. Come on, Mickey. Carry. I, I can't get the launch egg with Mickey Mantle. Now we get to have some fun. Oh, never mind. Shame on me for even considering trying to pinch hit Curtis Granderson. That's what I was going to do there. My bad pack luck would continue as I'd get base rounds in all three future star choice packs. And we still only had 199 overall. We are at the great stadium of Costco. Very small, high elevation. Nearly everything is a homer. Hold up. No, 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 no. We got to play it safe. I would have been out at home. Oh, come on. Yes. Come on. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Yup. Oh, <laughs> how is that a home run? <laughs> George Springer, 109 miles an hour. Okay, this might be on 500 foot watch. 496. No, I thought that was it. Come on. I keep on swinging at bad pitches with Mickey Mantle. It's so incredible. Okay, thank you. Goodness, he quit. I couldn't keep on hitting homers. With my first pack, I finished up season one by adding Bob Gibson from the boss pack. And I had six more season two packs to open. So I'd add John Franco, John Green, and Aaron Loop. And I'd get to add more 97 overalls with the event rewind pack. So I'd add Eduardo Escobar and Adam Adovino. And I'd open the Diamond Duo Choice Pack since we reached 20 home runs. So we have a great chance at a 99 overall. Oh, and we got it. <laughs> so I added Camilo Doval to lock down a bullpen. This team actually is getting better. You know, maybe one day we will hit a home run with Mickey Mantle. It is that day. Mickey Mantle has arrived. Finally. <laughs> it's funny because I'm actually so good with them. But for some reason today, I just have not been able to hit any homers with them. So frustrating. I'm such an idiot. What a bad game. Pathetic game there, Scan. You hit one homer. I think we're going to get the big dumper. Need to refocus. We just went from having our best game to our worst game, basically. Hey, it's not a home run, but I will take a lead off double all day. It's a hit. Come on. Come on, dumper. The big dumper. The big dumper. We have found the power stroke again. And right back to stinking again. Nice. Come on. Perfect, perfect. The center. Come on, Miguel Vargas. Yes. Sean Green. Welcome to the team. After a bounce back game with three home runs, I was hoping the same thing would happen with the packs. And now that I reached the alter ego packs, it seemed like it was happening. W rare rounds, honestly. 
That's some crazy luck. So I'd be able to add 99 Rhino and Brendan Crawford to the team. And this lineup was really coming together. Come on. Come on, Mickey. All right. Ryan Sandberg with 93 power hits a no doubter, but Mickey Mantle hits it to the wall. <laughs> oh, George Springer. Come on, we want a 500 foot bomb. We need more of swings like that. Man, I, I, I think this is a curse. There is some sort of curse with Mickey Mantle right now. Come on, get out of here. Get out of here, baseball. I need another homer. George Springer with the two homer game. After that quick three homer game, I would open the final alter ego pack with not great luck, but we get access to two season two boss packs, allowing me to add Josh Donaldson and Mariano Rivera, two really crucial 99s. And I still can't hit home runs with Nicky Mantle. It just doesn't make any sense. Is that fair? That's so confusing. It made the perfect, perfect sound. I've never seen that happen in this game. Come on. The bringer of rain. Perfect, perfect. Sean Green. Come on, baby. Deepest part of the park, or at least one of them. Really a fantastic game, honestly. I had a home run rob for me. Bunch of flyouts. I'm going to change up the strategy a little bit here. I'm going with my tried and true circles basic. This is going to work. So I can actually see the size of that inner PCI. So I got to open one season three pack. So I would choose Brent Rooker to add to the team. Yeah, you just look at that PCI. There ain't no way I'm not hitting a bunch of homers with this PCI. What a beautiful first swing. Man, that is, that is just got to be the theme of this video. I get easy to hit pitches, and I miss them. Time to switch to strike zone. I'm sorry. It does, doesn't look as nice, but your boy's got to win. There's one. It's so crazy how this happens, right? <laughs> Come on! One more! That ball is smacked. Come on! We tied it! Oh my goodness, again. Not a home run for Mickey Mantle, but that ball was destroyed. That's hitting the gap. GG's, I'm just gonna take my win. I think what we learned is that I need to use strike zone one. And this was without a doubt my best game. We hit eight home runs, which meant I had a lot of packs to open. And I'd add 97 Devin Williams, Jim Edmonds, and Tom Glavin. And I'd get some 99s by adding Max Clark, getting a rare round in this number retirement pack, pull Jock Peterson out of the season three boss pack. And just like that, I was on season four, meaning we had a 97 overall to pick. So I chose Aaron Judge, but there is no way he was starting on this team. And finally, I have 99 overalls in event rewind packs. So I'd add 99 Tatis to my last pack, and this team was suddenly really stacked. I just realized we still have two special challenges we haven't completed. We only got a few more games to get any of those. Come on, tell me that's one. Yes! And now Mickey Mantle wants to hit a home run. <laughs> Come on, hit the pole. Hit the pole! Yes! That's crazy timing. We get to spin that wheel of 99s again. Let's go, Fernando. <laughs> we got Mickey Mantle hitting tanks now, too. Yet again, we had a new best game. Nine home runs. So let's speed through these packs. I'd add Anthony Santander. I'd open five career tribute and pennant chase packs, which are not guaranteed diamonds. And I'd pull 99 Madison Bumgarner. I'd get Giancarlo Stanton in the season four boss pack. And then we jump into season five, where I'd add a 97 finest and I'd go for Brooks Rayleigh. And I'd wrap it up with Garrett Cole and Manny Machado in the event rewind packs. And what's crazy is I still had to spin the wheel of 99s. I have no idea who it's going to be until it literally shows the name. 
know. The team was stacked. I was playing well, and it seemed like this was not gonna stop anytime soon. That's a homer, okay. That's only 450. Yes, sir, Mickey. How many home runs do I have this game? I've honestly lost track. Man, Shield Woods is just such an absurd park. <laughs> and that would cap off another best game. That was 10 home runs. And we can open that chase pack since we have finally reached 50 homers. In my Great Race of 98 pack, I take Mike Piazza. In my 2023 Finest pack, I would take Evan Phillips. I'd take Ellie De La Cruz in this boss pack. So we'll take a shot at our chase pack. If we could somehow pull Randy Johnson, that would literally be our final game starter. And that could be really nice. But knowing me and my chase pack luck, it won't happen. Yeah. And I hit 50 home runs for apparently nothing. Since I hit extra home runs, surprisingly enough, I just ripped the rest of my packs. I started off with some rough luck in my Diamond Duo Choice packs, and then that quickly changed. I'd add Tom Glavin, John Franco, and Jason Giambi. I also didn't expect to hit enough home runs to get all the packs pretty easily. But yeah, none of those expectations matter because at this point, we have to play one final ranked game to see if I can even keep all of the cards that I earned in this video. Sure, we'll try that again. <laughs> I partially wish I didn't accept that friendly because I feel like this team is a bit better. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Besides the home run, that was a pretty solid inning. <laughs> what a bet. We've got a perfect, perfect moonshot. Look at Mickey Mantle, our very first 99 overall we added to the team. Come on, ball. Sit, sit. Let's go. This is a big at bat here, Giancarlo. Yes, Giancarlo, Oppo, Taco. Oh, maybe the sweeping curve gets the job done. Oh, Craig Biggio. Man, another good inning from Tom Glavin. And of course, Mickey Mantle came up. Oh, the Commerce Comet. I am glad that Mickey Mantle's decided to hit home runs in the games that matter most. All right, this team is so good, I probably am not getting a full game. I'm not gonna lie, that was a lot more fun than I expected. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you watch when I did this last year. I bet you'll enjoy that one too.